Meanwhile, a neighborhood walk with their dog turns into an expensive trip to vet for a Montgomery County family. Vets told them their lab had swallowed an edible that had THC in it. Aisha Khan's live from Clarksburg tonight, and vets are seeing more of these cases. Hey there, Jim. Yeah, you know, some, some of the vets we spoke with here in Montgomery County tell me that they just within the last month, they've noticed an uptick in these cases. Now, as you know, in the last few days, this has been pretty nice, except for today, which means more and more people are getting out and walking and walking their dogs. But that also could mean you know, potentially exposing your dog to something very dangerous they can find on the ground. These are photos of four-year-old Alora, the Labrador, being super active and playful just days before she became sick after a simple walk with her owner, Darina Genova of Clarksburg. About an hour later, she start, uh, started acting very weird. I almost f uh, had the feeling that maybe she overheated. Turns out Darina's 75-pound good girl, who looked very tired and was trembling, got into something bad, according to Dr. Deb Deans of Bennett Creek Hospital. The dog had eaten like a cookie or something that looked like a cookie that she had seen on a walk. And sure enough, those are, you know, those are the edibles that are now coming in all different forms. Dr. Dean says this isn't the first time she's come across such a case. In fact, she says cases involving house pets ingesting THC are going up across the country. I've had three in the last couple months. One was a ferret. Uh, yeah, fair, and unfortunately died. She says they are also seeing issues with CBD products being given to dogs. They're labeled THC free, but they're not. For them to label that, it, all it has to be is less than 0.3% THC, so it can still have some. Well, our dogs, the way they metabolize it in their fat, it's much more dangerous for their liver. She's much better now. Meanwhile, Laura has been getting the treatment she needs to recover, but Darina says she is still not back to being her playful self and warns parents of dogs and children to be aware so no one else gets hurt. Just be mindful. And there was definitely unnecessary also visit to the emergency room. The price is a completely separate ticket. But it was not even something that I caused. It was not something, you know, carelessness in my home. And Dr. Dean that you just heard from, she also tells me that you know, this could be even more dangerous, if not potentially 